This is a certified hood classic. Dog, my dog, my boys. Your boy was in a rut. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Your boy was in a bit of a rut, bro. But you know what, man? Um, some of the things that 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 really brought brought me out of that was first things first. I can't let y'all down. I can't let you, man. Look, we have so much fun on here, and I have fun. Don't get me. When I watch all these videos, when I do all these videos, they work. Don't get me wrong. I'm not gonna sit here and say that they ain't work. They are work. Because then I gotta record it, gotta edit it, and I don't like to just throw basic edits on my. Sh I like to actually do decent editing, yada yada, as much as 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 well as I can. We drop a lot of videos a week, but another thing um, besides that is y'all. Y'all have made me. I said, I said, look, man, we gotta drop some of these videos, cause man, boy, y'all comments be so inspiring. It be so inspiring. And then another thing is for your boy, you gotta. If you want to pull yourself out of rut, any rut that you're in, man, think about your life. Think about where you at. Think about where you want to go in life. My boys, I see a million subscribers in our damn range, my boys. I see it. I see that. I see it. ODG, one million subscribers. We gonna be lit, man. We gonna be turned up. I'm gonna be giving away all kinds of stuff. I'm gonna give away apartments. I'm gonna give away houses. I'm gonna give away hoes. I might even give away those. I'm gonna give away all kinds. I'm gonna give away cars, bro. I'm gonna be, man, baby, they, 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 woo. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. 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 Hell nah. You got Principal Victoria, she up there in the crowd too, boy. I, I don't like that, man. But but hey, you gotta establish some dominance in some way, boy. Okay. Uh, now, kids, we have a really fun motivational group today who are gonna talk to you about the dangers of smoking. Get your fat head ass up. So please give a very big South Park Cows welcome to Butt Out. No, boy, your ass need to butt in your head, boy. I'm finna get on this shit. Oh. Oh, I can tell they are gonna be some assholes, bro. I can all let me just go on here, sit back, and enjoy myself. I can tell they gonna do a musical or something. They gonna do a mu mark my word. They're gonna do a musical or something. Yeah, yeah. Give that cigarette Oh I no. Knew I knew it. That's how I felt. That's how I felt, Kyle. No, he no. Like fucking your mom. Hey, did you guys know that each year over 600,000 people a year die from smoking? A year? What? 600,000? That's ridiculous. Are you Shut sure up. you're not just blowing smoke? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. No way, because we don't need to smoke and neither do you, right kids? But how? Break it down. Oh, not a hip hop theme. Please, not a hip hop theme. Fuck that. <laughs> smoking, no, no smoking. Freestyle! <laughs> don't smoke. Don't ever smoke. Kyle! Kyle. To the T, to the T, to the O, to the O. Dude, this is unbearable. They don't beat to the O, to the O, to the E, to the O. This nigga ain't even saying words no more. He just said fuck words a long time ago. Freestyle, Kyle. B to the O to the I to the E to the O to the O to the point dot com. Look, what are you talking about? I'm going to kill don't the don't the go there. Don't go to the point. No fat. You go, you go, you go, you just say the no. You guys, Kenny's eating his own hand. Hey, what's the big deal? <laughs> it's I not like that smoking serious. and it makes me cool. Oh, really? Do you think lung cancer is cool too? What about emphysema? Is that cool? And what about abortion and AIDS? What the fuck does that have to do with <laughs> abortion and AIDS? What does that have to do with anything, bro? He just said just, just random shit, bro. He was like, man, you know what? I'm going to have a cigarette. He's like, well, what about abortion, AIDS, and metophilioma? Like, That's shut your bitch cool. ass up. Word. Remember, kids, if you smoke, you could grow up to be a failure. Worse yet, you could grow up to be dead. So don't believe what those evil tobacco companies tell you. <laughs> yeah, because if you don't smoke, you can grow up to be just like us. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> fuck no. <laughs> no, they hate for Give me another one. <laughs> Boy, uh, this is really hard. <laughs> he said, this, this is really hard. That's how I felt the first time I smoked the cig, bro. 
I don't smoke cigs, man. I don't smoke cigs. I don't. I don't even smoke weed no more, for real, for real. I ain't, I ain't knocking. Ain't nothing wrong with it. But I personally ain't gonna be able to bring y'all the amount of videos that I bring y'all if I smoke weed or that. I'm just be honest. That's just me. It ain't got nothing to do with you. If you, if you were, if right now, if you get ready to light one up, man, and lay back and chill and watch your boy, man. Hey, look, all power to you. Matter of fact, light another one up for your boy, cause guess what? This ain't gonna be all. <laughs> One day, back home. But bro, I'm just gonna say, when I had a, when I first smoked my first cig, bro, I didn't even smoke the whole thing, bro. I took it. I was at a movie theater. It was at Ronnie's movie theater in St. Louis, uh, like in the county. It was on our South County, man. Uh, look, man, I ain't gonna lie. My homeboy passed me. He's like, man, you want to hit this? I'm like, all right, cool, man. It's Newport, menthol. I, I, what the fuck is this? <laughs> I was like. Fuck, nah, I'm cool. You want to hit it again? No, bitch. <laughs> I'm good. Oh, shit, here comes Mr. Maggie. Oh, they fucking up. <coughs> Dude, here he comes. Stop, stop coughing. Y'all y'all caught. Y'all caught, bro. That's it. That's Boys, a what are you doing back here? <laughs> I asked you a question. What are you doing back here? Okay. Bro, just why? Cause why are y'all back there, bro? If y'all wasn't doing something y'all wasn't supposed to. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, <shit. laughs> well, hey, if I didn't know any better, I'd think you boys have been smoking. No, and you don't have any proof, bitch. He ain't got no proof. Because that, that ain't behind the coffin unless he finds cigarette butts. He ain't got no damn proof. <laughs> no, he no, good. They no, good. No, we don't have any cigarettes. <laughs> they ain't got well, no you proof. you better not, because let me tell you something about smoking. Uh, smoking's bad, okay? And uh, if you start smoking at an early age... Look, there go their fucking proof. <laughs> there go they fucking proof right there. <laughs> okay? It's gonna be bad. Mm -hmm. Oh because, shit! Uh, smoking can lead to all Tell kinds him. of problems like cancer. Tell okay, let me what? tell you something about cancer. Mm -hmm. Tell fuck uh, bro, Mr. Mackey's stupid. I know good and well he heard that. <laughs> I heard it, you heard it, you saw it in my intro. When I transitioned from the first scene to the next scene, there was a fire blast. <laughs> you heard it. Probably like Lizzo farts. Well, that's what it sound like. Okay. And, uh, what? What? Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> Holy shit, you <laughs> crazy? Oh, Shut, stop it, Mr. Slave. Just stop. Whoops. Damn. Well, you boys have yeah. certainly done it this time. What is going Mr. on here? Sorry. Not as sorry as you're going to be when your parents get here. Ah, here they come now. I, I'm pretty sure that you can get some type of lung, not cancer, but like you could, you don't want to sit around ashes. I'm pretty sure you can get sick that way. Somehow, some way, I'm pretty sure you can get sick that oh, way. Oh, God. Why are they sitting there? It's probably all moist. Come on in. Stan, uh, the boys were caught it's been a smoking. Minute. Smoking? No, it can't be. My son is not a filthy smoker. I have a feeling that they're getting ready to do the South Park shit and blow everything out of proportion. <laughs> That's typically what they do. That's typically Dad, what they I do. Just... I don't have a son. I and knew it. <laughs> you've done a lot of horrible things in your life, but smoking? You're grounded for three weeks. Three weeks? Are you fucking kidding me? That's Haven't it? Haven't you boys heard anything about how harmful smoking is to you and those around you? Of course they haven't because the tobacco companies have gotten to them first. This is really their fault. Your earrings yeah, are fucked up. Yeah, this is really their fault. No matter how much money the anti-smoking groups spend, the tobacco companies are there to fill our children's heads with lies and propaganda that make them want to smoke. You've been filled up with a whole lot with your fat beach ball body ass. Yeah, huh. It's like the tobacco companies have control of my mind. No, must fat it. Tobacco companies making me watch it smoke. You give him an oh inch, he goodness, take him out. no idea. Are you okay, sweetie? Uh, shut well, up. those goddamn tobacco <laughs> companies aren't going to have control over my kid. I say we bring them down. We need the help of the greatest anti-smoking celebrity that ever lived, Rob Reiner. Ah, remember, 
Blooms about talked about this episode. I lobbied didn't to get he? images of cigarettes removed from. Moon. Yes, he did. I think that was Blooms that talked about this episode, um, saying that this was the episode that pushed people over the edge, that made people feel like made people not care. South Park made people not care. Like, what the fuck? Come on now, man. Stop all that bullshit, bro. You know, people do things because they want to do things, bro. I don't give a damn what you're talking about. Yes, th things can influence people. But ultimately, influence means that people are... It, it's something... is outside substance that is literally trying to get you to do something. But ultimately, ultimately, it is a person's own thoughts their own passions, their own goals, their own dreams that make them do whatever the influence is trying to do. If somebody wanted to say, like, you know what? I can't say, ooh, that was a, that was a great example. But but that if I said that S word, that, that the boy, if I said that S word, boy, you two be on my black ass. I'm not. I force smokers out of bars and parks, but still I get letters from parents saying their kids are doing it. So fat ass. People still don't understand how bad smoking is for them. How don't bad is the fatty? Don't they know how dangerous it is to their health? Don't they know the hazard of secondhand smoke? But according to the letter, sir, the town has uh. a tobacco company quite near them. Yeah, that must be it. <laughs> the tobacco companies with their millions of dollars and their slick desks and fancy buildings, they're the ones making children want to smoke. <laughs> they're the ones hurting our nation. God, bro, slow down. I'll stand by and see the children... Nigga is a cheeseburger, boy. If you don't slow the hell down. America corrupted by your bastards. This is war. This is war. Maybe we should come clean right now and tell everyone that it wasn't the tobacco companies. They can hang around with villains what? and Why? shit. Why? It's perfect. If everyone's blaming the tobacco companies, then nobody's blaming us. Yeah, what's the problem? Well, it's just that this seems like another one of those times when things are going to get way out of hand, you know? It's been happening a lot lately. How shit. about this time we just put a stop to it right now? Yep. Dumbass, you don't want to be grounded for three weeks, do you? Yeah, don't worry, dude. Things aren't going to get out of hand. Man, you know they are, bro. You know they are, man. Just for him saying that shit, you already know they are. Here he comes! Fat boy! Poor child! Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! Butter! Butter! You lying. What did he say? You are lying, Butter! bro. I know the good and well you know. <laughs> oh no, did y'all see him eat a little bit? He gonna oil, he gonna butter himself down. He's... <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on, bro. I got to see that again, bro. Hold butter! On. What'd he say? Butter! Get your fat ass. <laughs> Look like Alex Jones, boy. <laughs> They doing him bad. It is so nice to see an entire town come together to fight for good health. Fuck you. <laughs> and I'm going to help you. These poor, innocent children have been seduced into smoking tobacco. So I say, we fight loyal with loyal. He just We're can't wait. Children to bring the tobacco company down. What the fuck? Oh, no. Bro, his fat ass can't even wait. He's so damn hungry. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to sneak you into eating. the tobacco company by saying you kids want a tour for a school paper. <laughs> What's your thought? Mm -hmm. I, sw I swear on my life, that is one of the biggest things that annoy the hell out of me, bro. Is when people are, t like, you have the floor. You are the speaker. You are telling us something either that you want to do, telling something that happened, telling something that I should do. And during the whole time, I'm listening, everybody else is listening, and your fat ass is eating. And then they stuff food in their face, and then they try to talk. Like, imagine if I did that, bro. Like, hey, y'all, man, welcome back to another reaction. I just want to... Oh, you here. Nigga, you rushing eating. You ain't enjoying it. You're fat as hell. I'm waiting for you to finish... We're just staring at each other. This shit weird, bro. It's I'm awkward. gonna take photos and then we'll publish them saying that the tobacco company invited you over he to it. seduce you into smoking. Got it? Got it. But lying. Isn't that kind of lying? Kinda is. We're lying. just leveling out the playing field. 
The tobacco companies lie to you about the dangers of smoking. If we're gonna take them down, we've gotta lie right back. Fight fire with fire, huh? Hamburger with hamburger. Nigga, smell somebody fart. Oh my god! <laughs> that nigga could tell what you ate yesterday through the fart. And <laughs> shit. You have wet word pie! Stupid ass, boy. Uh, yesterday, uh, 2 o'clock. Uh, uh, Excuse oh, me! Here we yes. go. Would you mind putting that dead stick out? But, uh, oh. this is a bar. Isn't smoking <laughs> illegal in bars here? Not in Hell Colorado. No. Oh my god, what kind of backward hick state is this? Is smoking illegal Look, now man, in, I in places? I work hours a day at the sawmill. I haven't seen I just this. got off work and I need to relax. Well, when I relax, I just go to my vacation house in Hawaii. I ain't got a vacation house in Hawaii. Your vacation house in Mexico, then. Whatever it is. Look. I get it. I get it. He's so far disconnected from people. He doesn't understand that this is this is their freedom to do what they want. Now, while I don't know, I mean, I do I do think big tobacco companies are marketing do market to kids. I do I do feel like that. I do feel that way. Um, but I see this dude, uh, what's his name, Rob Reiner or something like that. He's so out of touch with reality, thinking that everybody is just like him, that. He, the, the guy at the bar just want to sit, enjoy his cigarette, enjoy his beer, you know, duck his family for a little bit, go home and be unhappy. You know, that's what his, that's what he has in store for him at home. Why I just made up that sad as this is for him, I don't know. I'm sorry for him. But at the same time, bro, at the end of the day, that is a lot of people's reality. And they don't appreciate being fucked with at the end of the day at a bar by a fat boy. Fat guy, fat man, roly poly, beach ball. You are putting my life blah, blah, blah. and these boys' lives in danger Humpty by Dumpty. smoking that in here. And I'm not going to tolerate it. I will end smoking in bars in Colorado. Nothing wrong with be being no fat. More smoking. Just lose some weight. Isn't he awesome, you guys? <laughs> what? Dude, he just goes around imposing his will on people. He's my idol. I bet he is. I really do. Fat boy. All right, boys. Just do what I tell you, and we'll Who's be able to sue this tobacco so. company for $2 billion. As soon as we get into the main facility, I'll snap the photo of you kids, and we can all run out. Think you can handle it? Handle it? For two billion dollars, I'd handle my grandpa's balls, sir. <laughs> oh, no. No, you you would handle Butter's balls for, for less than that. That boy handled some semen in, in a few episodes back. <sighs> Fucking now, weirdo. Those kids. These tobacco company people will do anything to get you hooked on smoking. No, they, they won't. They are liars, and they are frauds. Can I help you? Yes. Oh, my name is fuck? Rita Poon. I called about Rita my Poon. boys wanting a tour. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, Mrs. Poon. <laughs> my name's Kevin Harris, and I'm the vice president of Big Tobacco. Oh, hello, Mr. Harris. Well, come uh, on in. I don't like that. How about a little history first? Native Americans... I've seen black people on the plantation. Plant. They smoked it in pipes for medicinal and ceremonial purposes. Not if I were around, they wouldn't have. Excuse <laughs> me? No, nothing. Please continue. Right. The first Called successful commercial out. crop of tobacco was cultivated in Virginia in 1612. Within seven years, it was one of the country's largest exports. So, tobacco helped to build America. That's right. Over the next... I have a feeling. I swear. This is the scene. They're going down to history. I have a feeling it's going to get racist. I will apologize if it doesn't. I will apologize for stopping the video if it doesn't. But I swear to God. A few centuries, the tobacco business was so great that many slaves were brought from Africa to help work the fields. Which means if it weren't for tobacco, many of our black friends wouldn't be here today. And so for centuries, tobacco production flourished. But nobody was Boy, aware of any dangers back then. <laughs> until in 1965, when Congress passed an act forcing all tobacco companies to put the Surgeon General's warning on their packages. Fuck you! <laughs> With me, if it wasn't for tobacco, many of our black friends wouldn't be here. Fuck you. I don't want. I don't want to. I don't want to go to the comments and see someone saying, "Well, I mean, but is he wrong?" Fuck you too. <laughs> fuck you too, bro. You shit. So now oh, everyone knows the holler. dangers of smoking. That's and hilarious. Some people still choose to do it, and we believe that's what being an American is all about. Oh fuck that you too. That sounds perfectly reasonable. <laughs> and here's our factory at work. 
Oh, God. I would love to see T. Keith remix that. A Kanye West. I like to have to with a Heidi Lighty Lighty and a Heidi Lighty Lay. We work and we make cigarettes all Heidi Lighty Day. Well, I guess that's the end of our tour. Oh, here, boys. Let me get your picture. Uh, oh, Got shit. Ha! You oh. bastards are going down now. And what? the tour was going I'm so Ryan well. Boone. I'm Rob Reiner. And I'm you're Rob just Reiner. Come on, boys. <laughs> let's make our escape. I'm Rob so Reiner, and you've just been Reiner. Try and stop it. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, what oh the fuck? God. Oh my god. Oh boy, that was great, kids. What? Those people at the tobacco company all seem really nice. Yeah, they you are. See that? They got into your head. Now you kids can meet some good, decent people. The folks who work to get smoking banned. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here, boy? The, that nigga working for the undead, boy. What the fuck, nigga work for the the count? What the fuck is the, yeah, yes. What the fuck wrong with you, boy? The fuck? <laughs> These niggas trying to take over the world, but this is a lair. If I ever seen one, they are, that's not a facility. That is a lair, bro. <laughs> this is how we get rid of smokers. With sandwiches, okay. We go state to state and do things like use bogus studies and make expensive commercials to get the public on our side and force cigarette smokers to stop. So y'all lying. Wow. Though. It's like it's like smoking brings a lot of people just a little bit of joy and, and you get to take that away from them. You're <laughs> so awesome. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Look at Robert. this he nigga here. Photoshop work. Now all we have to do. That nigga be on the dark web posting pictures of of, of, of children. It's Photoshop cigarettes into your head. And bingo. When this hits the papers, the tobacco Look at him. He proud of his work. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're making stuff up. You kids need to understand something, okay? Sometimes lying is okay. No, like it's not. when you know what's good for people more than they do. Don't lie, oh bro. God, that is exactly what I've always said. I love this guy. Mr. Don't, Ryan, don't lie, your no, bill to no, have don't smoking lie, out loud in bars here didn't pass. What? God damn it, what the hell is wrong with people in this state? Apparently several people here still That boy got that Vladimir Putin haircut. Don't you believe there's no proof secondhand smoke can kill you? I'm not allowed in Russia. Alright, we'll this. give them proof. Boy, I need one of you to act in a commercial for us. We'll shoot it tomorrow. Wow, a commercial? And you boys decide which one of you would be best for the part. Alright, people, we Don't gotta get moving shit. on the bill of man smoking in parks here. Let's Don't go. do that shit, man. They be tripping. The best. Mr. Ryder, can I get you a muffin or, or a cold drink, perhaps? Get your soft You guys, ass off I think me. we should bail out of this right now. Huh? I just know where this is heading. It's gonna end up with the whole town taking this too far and us having to talk about what we learned to change everyone's minds. And I say we just stop it right now and go play cards or something. Facts, Ooh, facts, oh, facts, oh. facts. Yeah, maybe you're right. So, gentlemen, looks the like only one of us not is convinced. in the commercial, huh? Who will it be? Gentlemen, the game is on. Go ahead. We don't want to be in their stupid commercial. Huh? Oh, I get it, Kyle. That's your Serbian Jew double bluff. Make me think you don't care <laughs> about being in the commercial so that maybe I won't either. Oops, He's so racist, man. Have. No, we really want nothing more to do with these people. <clears throat> sure you don't, Kyle. Oh, and neither do I. Oh, I know what you're going to say next. You're going to say, how about none of us show up tomorrow to do it? And then I'm supposed to agree so that tomorrow you can watch it all by yourself and do the commercial. That Serbian Jew double bluff, and it ain't going to work on me. <laughs> he's a, and it ain't going to work on me. <laughs> hey, he's an ass, man. Look, I can understand his way of thinking, but you know... That is very much projected, bro. You know, when you 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 project how you feel about a lot of things onto people. I noticed that. I noticed that. I do it. You do it. Other people do it. You know, it's real easy to do it because, you know, you're thinking like, okay, you have to be like that because I'm like this. And it don't have to be bad. It, it could be good. It could be good. It's like, you know, have you, have you ever thought about when you be like, oh, I know that you're going to help me out because I'm helping you out. It's not saying that you need to help me out. It's just like, I know that you would do that for me because I'm doing it for you. I'm projecting how I feel on that person. Their intent might not be to help people out. In fact, it might be repulsive to them. But at the same damn time, at the same time, you got to start checking that shit inside you that say you got to start checking your projections and your insecurities, man. <laughs> 
Only one of us Gotta can check that shit. The game. Well, get on, fat fuck. <laughs> fat fuck. <laughs> Was this the end? <laughs> All right. Look at the end of the video, huh? Sorry, Kyle, but I'm afraid only one of us will be showing up to do the commercial tomorrow. <laughs> it is not that serious. You with your Serbian Jew double bluff, didn't you? Well, let's see you try to open this door now. <laughs> You know he evil, cause all evil people say they master plan as as they do it or something. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> gotcha. Oh, hello, cat. Hello, cat. <laughs> oh man, wait, this isn't my house. Carmen, you go ahead and do the commercial tomorrow. But I'm warning you, those anti-smoking people are liars and they're bullies who will stop at nothing to get what they want, and that means they're dangerous. Damn, for sure. Are you stupid, bro? His door opens <laughs> inwards. <laughs> nice bag, huh? Let's see you try to get through this door now. <laughs> That's so stupid, bro. Okay, Eric, so this is going to be real simple. All you got to do is just read the words on the teleprompter here. <laughs> okay. Let's see how the tobacco company deals with it. Nobody else showed up either. All right, roll camera. Roll the teleprompter. And whenever you're ready, Eric. <laughs> okay, okay. You know... Some people say there's oh, no proof God. that secondhand smoke kills. I bet. But tobacco companies say there's no proof that secondhand smoke kills. I've just been diagnosed with terminal lung cancer. Damn. I guess I'm the proof. The next time you want to believe that secondhand smoke doesn't kill, think about me. Because by the time you see this commercial, I'll be dead. Damn. Dead. <laughs> right, right. We got it. Uh oh. Wrap out, people. That was fantastic. Uh -oh. Uh oh. What does that mean? I'll be dead. Hey, look! Look how that guy collected the core, bro. Sucks to be you. <laughs> he just look at him. He like he just collected the core. You like, yeah, hey, boy. That's who. That's fucked up. That's fucked up place. I'm working. I work for the studio. I don't work for them. Hey, uh, what what was that dead part? That was very good, Eric. Here, eat this cupcake. No, bro. You drugging uh, bitch, you vampire know, bitch. But you are. Just eat this one cupcake. Man got Kodak Black grills in his mouth. Gold grills, boy. Man. I used to want that shit in 2007. What the fuck? Sprinkles. Actually, I wouldn't mind getting another one. I'm not eating the cupcake. Right. Don't you eat hey, that. Do you know what a hero is? A hero is somebody who sacrifices himself for the good of others. Fuck that. You can be a hero, Eric. Fuck that. All you have to do is eat the cupcake. No. Hell, run! 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 <laughs> His undead ass. That man was a uh, uh, pissy yellow, a uh, 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 honey mustard dirty yellow. Like I don't, I would never trust a nigga that's that's like that. The color of spoiled uh, cream cheese. Like fuck nah, bro. Like look, look, look bro, what, I'm not handing, I'm not taking anything from your little filthy ass hands, nigga. Like shit, I fuck around and eat that shit and turn yellow too. Fuck nah, fuck you, fuck you. Crab people looking ass. That nigga, one of the crab people. <laughs> uh oh. What are you doing, Cartman? Look, They're going to kill me. He's up on his tiptoe. Who's going to kill you? The anti-smoking people. They had me say I died from secondhand smoking. Now they want to sacrifice me to make it look real. They'll stop it. Nothing. Well, get away from us then. Yeah, right. Don't get us killed too. Oh, but they you fake. You have to help me. No, you get away. Please, you guys. I don't know what to do. Stop it, Cartman. Go die on your own. If I That's go, crazy. you guys go. Dad. What? Y'all wonder why Carmen be messed up in the head. Like, I get it. But if that was Kyle, oh, my God, dude. Uh, uh, I need some fucking help, Stan. He would be like, well, well what are we going to do, dude? He would have been saved him. They always, there's been several times Tweak has offered to kill Carmen. They have offered to just let Carmen die. There's been a lot of times they, they try. Remember on that episode where they got the good Carmen from another parallel universe? They were trying to send that Carmen to that universe. Like what the fuck are you talking about? Like why would you do that? That like that's so selfish. They are so selfish. And then you wonder why Carmen is this asshole, bro. I'm telling you, bro. I know that I go bounce back and forth with Carmen being an asshole and everything, but I'm telling y'all, it is the friends that he keeps around him. They don't care about him, bro. The anti smoking they don't. people are trying to kill Carmen and he won't stay away from us. Don't be ridiculous, boys. The anti-smoking people are kind, caring, and intelligent. Your heads uh. have just been corrupted by the lies of the big tobacco companies. <laughs> Randy's starting to get a hey, bigger part. I like maybe that. Maybe the tobacco company can help us. Help you, fat ass. We weren't in the commercial, remember? Yeah, go to the tobacco company yourself. Well, that's fine. I thought you guys were my friends, but I guess I was wrong. Yeah, dude, you were totally wrong. 
<laughs> Damn. You guys, I, I'm see, going to get that's a messed up. Now. now come on, we're going to the tobacco company. Oh, that's messed right. up. No, what we really should do is go to our parents right now and take responsibility for smoking ourselves, even if it means getting grounded. Why? Shut up. Because if we go to the tobacco company, I know exactly what will happen. They'll take us in, and then Rob Reiner will show up with all the townspeople holding torches or something, and there'll be a big showdown until we talk about what we learned and change everyone's minds. This is all following a formula. Yeah, so he ain't lying. deal with all that or be grounded for three weeks. He ain't lying. <laughs> they still did it anyway. And look at his dead ass. God damn it. Give us the child. We will not. Yeah, you see that? The tobacco company won't give us the kid. And he got a big why? piece of cake. Because they know that if they give us that kid, then we'll kill him. And when our commercial goes on the air, we'll lose that business. Yeah! Wait a minute, what? Oh, <laughs> right! <laughs> People are gonna think it's because of secondhand smoke. And then these bastards are gonna make money, and they know it! I'd see, you know what? I'm so glad that he said that. Because it's like, now the tap piece of, people at South Park are stupid. They ain't that dumb. Well, what the hell is wrong with you? That's not right. Oh, God damn it. Do I have to explain this again? Smoking is bad, people. So if we have to be a little extreme to stop it, it's okay. Her, his fat no, ass been eating cake all learn. day. Because I learned something today. You just hate. See? I knew it. Yep. Yeah, you just facts. hate smoking. So use all your money and power to force others to think like you. And that's called fascism, you tubby asshole. Yes, it is. Don't be no more smoking. Man, 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 man. We smoked. It was our fault. Us. We should all take personal responsibility instead of letting fat fascists like him tell us what to do. You're right, boys. Okay. Yeah, let smokers smoke. Yeah. 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 Hey, Mr. Sure. Reiner, why don't you butt out? <laughs> <laughs> I'm warning you. Don't mess with anti smoking groups. I don't idolize you anymore, asshole. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, wow. My goo. My precious goo. What? <laughs> what the fuck is so, going Kyle, on? It wasn't the tobacco company that made you want to smoke? This nigga got pissed on him. Look, I'm, I'm getting sick and tired of this. This nigga got pissed on him. What is them yellow marks? She is with stupid. This man got pissed on him. He told me some, my goo, my precious goo. <laughs> this nigga start melting. <laughs> boy, this nigga got, this nigga start minimizing, boy. Like when you, like when Mario get hit, boy, is this nigga. Brruh, brruh, brruh. All right, what the no. fuck? Well, then you are grounded. This Tessa. is a great episode. You too, Eric. Ah, ah. Gotcha. Well, I guess we learned our lesson. No, you didn't. No, the fuck. No, you didn't. Y'all, man, that is another video, man, for the day, man. So, look, y'all, here's the biggest lesson. Don't, don't go on Cornhub, all right? That is the lesson of the day, my boys, man. Don't go on that shit. No fap, man, all right? Don't fap. Don't, you know, fap, that's the noise you make when you're saying, ha, all right? Don't do it, all right? I'm telling y'all, man. I'm telling y'all. Be real. Don't do it. Oh. And uh, about South Park, <laughs> looking at, uh, yeah, man, you know, whoop-de-doo.